All right, everybody, you're on the Corona Diaries right now. Everybody say hi. 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 Wait, what happened to my mask guy? I have to talk, and then it'll come up on the main. Ah. Hi, everybody. I'm going to be a little more transparent today. I know you think I might be making lunches or playing with leprechauns or whatever else I'm posting, but day three is getting real. So I have been on the phone and answering emails since eight o'clock this morning. And I usually go until about 11.30 at night. I can tell you I haven't worked this many hours. I work a lot of hours, but this is a whole new game for me. Um, information's changing all the time and I'm going to try really hard to make sure that you're getting everything that you need to make decisions. But because this is light about what's happening in my home, I thought that today I'm going to be very clear about what's happening in our home. So that work, that you got from your teachers again is to keep your kids engaged and to make sure that you know they don't lose the skills they already learned we made sure it was equitable and that kids had resources um, but these don't count as our days to make up so i know that's the big question and i'm trying to find answers as fast as i can and to make sure i don't give you any misinformation and change information on you all the time so with that being said you might think as a teacher, a principal, a head of school, that I am sitting at the table and when the timer goes up, I'll say academic time is over, it's time for playtime or creative time, and that is just not the case right now. So I know some of you are thinking, how do I juggle keeping my kids engaged and making sure they get the skills that they need and also the playtime and the fresh air along with working in your jobs. And I can tell you in my house that it's kind of, everybody is doing their own thing. Um, I've given some assignments and I'll show you how that's going so far. So I came outside because the lighting isn't very good inside and in no judgment, remember, I have not been available to my home. So there is a lot of mess that you're going to see. There is no judgment here because I'm being very real on day three. All right, so, and, and notice that I didn't shower today. You got a hat today um, and that's just the way it's gonna be. And I'm sure as the day goes on, you won't even get a hat. So all transparency here. So all right, I'm gonna flip my camera around. When I said when I said chores, this is what I'm talking about. Let's see here. Okay, dishwasher still needs to be unloaded. Dishes still need to be put in. Uh, we made lunch and we didn't clean it up. So parents out there, don't be too hard on yourself. It happens in every home. Clothes to be folded, shoes to be put away. Everybody's dealing with fighting the chores. All right, so we're gonna go upstairs and see what the kids are up to. Let's see. Oh, this is what I suspected. This is what I thought. What, what? are we doing? Playing video games. Did you do any schoolwork today? Yeah, I finished it all. You did? Yeah. Did you get to talk to any classmates online? Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, what did you get to talk about? What? What did you talk about? Um, no, we didn't talk with classmates. You didn't? No. Oh, just your teacher? Yeah. How'd that go? Good. All right. Bye. Bye. So Julia is sewing. Ah. <laughs> Hi, Jewel. Hi. Did you get any schoolwork done today? Yeah. Yeah? You sewing? Yes. What are you making? I'm making a top. Okay. Uh, jeans. All right. That sounds fun. Yeah. Maybe we can see that tomorrow. I'm glad you're keeping busy. I thought you were going to be on Netflix. No. AirPods, life changer. <laughs> and there's Kona, the dog. She is by my husband's side because really my husband is the only one who gives her some nice walks and <laughs> plays with her. Hey there, Rob. Hello, everybody. Isn't he handsome? This is HR, Rob Bishop. Handsome Rob. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Bishop, right here. What you doing there, Rob? Getting some things done. Working on some uh, virtual visit calls and emails right now because of the coronavirus. So it's yeah. kind of out of control right now. You've been on your phone. It's been tethered to your ear. And many of your colleagues have said, take it away from you. So take I, my phone? Take your phone, which is almost impossible. <laughs> so I did give her some AirPods to work with. AirPods, life changer. Thank you for that. Absolutely. And then later on today, 
I'm gonna take you on a little uh, date walk. Date walk? Step up the game while we're doing well, coronavirus style. But I'm so impressed, a date walk. Everybody should go for a date walk. This is something that I have up on my wall, so I'm gonna end today's with as much as life is very busy. Life is simply better in the in the country here in Chester County. Let's go out for a walk right here with Kona. This is the oasis Kona has. There you go, Kona. Enjoy a little bit of serenity today in all of your busy schedules. Oh, Kona sees something she's gonna go get. But enjoy your Wednesday, day three. Hang in there, everybody, hang in there.